I'm sorry if I seem uninterested or I'm not listening or I'm indifferent Truly, I ain't got no business here, but since my friends are here, I just came to kill Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I had to film another glitter look. This time I used red glitter and I filmed like a red glitter smoky eye. So if you want to see how I got this look, please keep watching. Alright, so I did my brows off camera using my Brows by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And we're going to start off by priming our eyelids with our Urban Decay Primer Potion. Now I'm taking the color Cocoa Bear by Makeup Geek and with a fluffy blending brush, I'm going to put that in my transition area. And now to deepen up my crease area, I'm taking the color Americano by Makeup Geek and the color Carbon by MAC and I'm going to put that in my crease. And of course you want to blend as always. Now I'm going into this Revlon Cream Shadow Palette and I'm taking this lightest color right here. I'm going to go ahead and put that all over my lid and this is going to act as a base. And I'm going back in with Cocoa Bear and I'm going to go ahead and set that cream shadow. And you know, blend as usual. Okay, so now I'm taking this NYX glitter glue as well as this red NYX glitter and I'm going to put that all over my lid. And if you guys saw my previous glitter video where I used this gold glitter for MAC, you'll know that I got the glitter literally everywhere without even trying to. And this glitter, it wasn't as messy. I don't know how or why, but it just wasn't. And I also used a smaller um, shader brush so that the glitter wouldn't get everywhere. Now I'm taking this highlighter by Becca in the color Opal and I'm going to go ahead and highlight under my eyebrows. So I'm going to line my eyes with my Kat Von D tattoo liner which I'm obsessed with. And um, using eyeliner over glitter is really hard so it probably would be best to use a liquid eyeliner. Um, I obviously didn't think to do that in the video but I would definitely suggest using a liquid eyeliner if you're gonna do eyeliner over glitter because if not and you're using a felt tip like me it's gonna take a lot of arm work so just be prepared so now I'm putting on a coat of mascara on my lashes so that I can prep them for the falsies that I'm gonna use and I'm using these falsies from Sephora. I actually forgot that I had these. I was in my lash drawer looking for some lashes and I came across these untouched, unopened, so I had to use them. But um, they're in the style Fleur and I actually really like them. So definitely put on some falsies when you're doing your makeup. Okay, so now we're gonna start on our face. We're gonna start off by priming our face. I'm using the Makeup Forever primer. Um, it's a magnifying primer. And I'm also going to use another primer by Smashbox, the Photo Finish Primer. The Makeup Forever Primer is for my is to combat my oiliness, and the Smashbox Primer is to help um, with application. So now I'm going to color correct. I'm using Max Prep and Prime and Peach Luster. For foundation, I'm using this Becca Ever Matte Shine Proof Foundation, which I recently picked up, and I am absolutely loving. Um, this is a mattifying foundation and being that I'm an oily girl, super oily girl, anything mattifying I love, this seriously keeps my face matte. So they say that's comparable to the L'Oreal Infallible foundation which I also have but as when it comes to oiliness I feel like this definitely keeps me more matte for way longer. So um, if you haven't tried this, you have got to try it. Seriously, try it. Thank me later. At least get a sample and try it. <laughs> but I love this foundation. And I'm in the color Tobacco. And to highlight, I'm using the concealer from NARS. It's in the color Biscuit. Remember to set your highlight. I'm setting mine with this translucent powder from Laura Mercier, which I picked up not too long ago. 
well a couple months ago I would say by now and um, I'm really liking it I normally use my Ben Nye banana powder but I have been reaching for this lately more I think um, just because it's something new and different but I still like my Ben Nye banana powder the main difference is that the Ben Nye one has a yellow undertone to it but they both work great if you ask me and I was jamming while filming this video if you can tell like jamming all right have my own little concert so now I'm gonna go ahead and contour I'm gonna contour my nose as well as the sides of my face and I'm using this um, LA girl pro concealer in the color dark cocoa um, I'm also gonna set this with my Guerlain terracotta bronzing powder in the color ebony So once I'm done doing all of that, I'm going to wipe away the translucent powder. So now I'm going to set my whole face with my Max Mineralized Skin Finish and this is also going to help blend everything together. For blush, I'm using this NARS blush in the color Glue. Now I'm going into Jackie Aina Holiday Gift Set. I'm going to be using her Diamond Glow Powder in the color Le Bronze to highlight my face. For lips, I'm going to be using this nude lipstick from MAC called Velvet Teddy. I'm also going to be lining my lips with a dark lip liner in the color Espresso. And to top it off, I'm going to be using a nude lip gloss from the Booksum collection and it's called the color, it's in the color Cha Cha Cha. And you know you gotta set your face and take a selfie. So I hope you guys enjoyed this red glitter look. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to leave a comment, thumbs up this video, and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!